Hello people of the internet, my name is Xenoclips, and in this video we are checking out Dave the Diver. I have not seen much on this game, I've tried to keep myself very unaware to games I'm trying to play, so not to spoil anything, but the only thing I do know is the whole premise of this game is that we are running a little sushi restaurant and we just have to go and get the fish ourselves. That's all I know, so. With that being said, it is Friday, so I have to say this. If your Friday's not going too well, I'm sorry to hear that, but I hope this video cheers you up and makes your Friday just a little bit better. And with that, guys, let's get into Dave the Diver. Ah, here we are, nice and relaxed. Look little crab boy here. Hey, yo, for free? Calm down, hold up. Put them dogs... Hey, yo, put them dogs away. Is this our boy Dave? Oi. What are you doing, little guy? Yo, who's this mob boss right here? They're talking simlish. Ah, <laughs> uh, see, these are their, these are the good Friday vibes, you know. Dave the Diver, my boy Dave right here. He's a real chat. He's drinking root beer. Root beer is my favorite soda. I love root beer. Here we oh. are. Oh, I gotta. Oh, guys, I gotta read. Okay, here we go. Maybe I'll do a little voice for all of them. I feel like this guy is more of like a. Oh, Dave. You got here quickly. Well, I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. So where's the sushi at? Ah ha ha. Don't rush yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like this. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which means... This would be an incredible business opportunity. Yeah. What kind of business? Well, we need to discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? Oh. I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go on in. <laughs> uh, I don't have a good feeling about this. <laughs> Jesus Christ, my voice acting is awful. I'm so sorry. Let's do this. Let's get some sushi. I gotta say, I love sushi. I'm a big fan of sushi. Oh wow, this game is so pretty. Oh, here we go. Nice form, ha ha ha. All right, how about try stretching out a bit? Try moving to the marked area. With the shift, you can move quickly. Remember that this speeds up oxygen consumption. All right, go fast. No, we don't need to go fast. Okay, maybe go a little fast. Good, looks like your skills are intact. I think the voice has changed a little bit, not gonna lie. Uh, it's <laughs> I can't remember how to do the voice even though I just did it. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Now let's practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies, the dive knife. Try using the survival knife on small fish. You could use the left mouse button. All right, come here. Come here. <laughs> come here. I gotta, I gotta go slow about it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm not actually kidding anything. Well done! Smooth and quick. I didn't hit anything. Was I supposed to hit something? And finally, you haven't forgotten how to use the harpoon, have you? <laughs> the harpoon? Well, I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first? And then, hmm. Well, looks like you'll need some practice. Let's try using the harpoon to catch, let's say, three fish. Aim with the right mouse button and then fire with the left. Now let's try it out yourself. All right, let's uh. Do, 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 do. Oh wait, where are the fish? There we go. I got that bad boy, pyramid butterfish. Oh okay, it really doesn't have that much range here. Right here. Boom, baby, got another one. Oh, let's get Dory here. I hope your childhood was good. Boom, baby, blue tang. I think you should get back on track in no time. All right, come back up to the boat. Guys, this voice acting is so hard. <laughs> okay, now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? Oh, for sure. That soft fish meat with oily rice? Oh, man. 
That's just the best. <laughs> oh, this is, this is... I'm so sorry. Ah, well listen up. I have a friend who is a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has the one skill that I guarantee is unmatched in the world. It is right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. Bro, his name's Cobra. That's why I'm trying to give him more of a grand voice. The sushi sold here is made with fresh fish caught in the blue hole where fish from all over the world can be found. Do you think people will just go nuts for it? Yum. I'm already craving it. Aha, I bet. So? Why don't you join me in this awesome venture as well? What do you say? <gasps> I mean, I love eating, but I don't know a thing about cooking. Nothing to worry about. The restaurant is all ready. All you need is a dive to get the ingredients. Doesn't sound too bad, right? I'm gonna accept this offer, baby. Oh, so I can eat as much sushi as I want? Uh, yeah, sure. You have to pay for it, though. Oh, can't wait to check it out. The sushi restaurant next to the Blue Hole. It's supposed to open tonight, but I'm not sure if it's ready. Let's go have a chat at the restaurant. Ah -ha -ha! I'm loving this art style right now. Hey, Bancho! I'm hoping is that's how you pronounce it. Hey, Bancho! Are we all ready to open? As you can see, it's ready just in time. Oh, it's already finished? You! Ah, you are that fisherman Cobra was talking about. Well, I'm more of a diver than a fisherman. Alright, anyway, it's nice to meet you. I'm Bancho. Or Bonko? Bonko actually sounds cooler, actually, now that I think about it. I'm gonna ch It's. I don't know how it's pronounced. I'm gonna say Bonko, because Bonko sounds like, you know, I don't know, more like tropical. I'm Bonko. So you lack sushi? I sure do. Tuna belly, eel, sea urchin. Oh boy, just think about it makes my mouth water. Hmm, just as mediocre as I expected. Sushi is a food that combines the soul of the sea and land. It symbolizes Mother Nature herself. Most people, however, have only tasted more accessible fish just like you. How empty of life is one that ends without ever tasting the beauty Mother Nature can offer? My calling is to bring the taste of Mother Nature to everyone. What is that? Is that an earthquake? Well, that's not very good. What the hell was that, guys? The, the place is destroyed. An, an earthquake? Hmm, the interior is really quite a mess. Yeah, it looks like we'll have to delay the opening today. You know what? I spent all my money getting this restaurant ready. I'll have to recover the repair costs through doing business. In this state? <laughs> In the end, the importance of a restaurant is the taste. First, we need ingredients. Did you bring anything? Well, I have something I just caught. Mm. Only three fish? This won't be nearly enough to serve the guests. Please go catch seven more fish first. Oh, and the restaurant's only going to be open in the evening. Hmm, won't that decrease sales? We think we should invite customers without adequate preparation just to make a little bit more money? It is the chef's duty to prepare the best possible food with meticulous precision, just as a warrior sharpens his sword on a whetstone. You will need to get me the best quality ingredients during the day. Okay. Man, first day opening and the place is already destroyed. It seems Bonko is really passionate about his work. Ah, uh, he may not talk about personal stuff, but this guy can talk about sushi all night. <laughs> I haven't seen Bonko so enthusiastic since the incident. It's nice to see him like this. The incident? Oops, maybe I shouldn't have brought that up. Well, anyway, we need seven more ingredients, so go catch seven more fish first. Alright, so mission is to go catch some fish. So we need to make a hundred gold. So, okay, but we definitely need to catch some fish first. Alright, baby, watch my amazing aim skills. Ready, watch this. Boom! <laughs> Just like that. Boom, what is that? I don't know what that is. Rainbow Rass? I mean, I'll take it. All right, we got some dories right here. Boom, baby. Let's go down a little deeper here. 
Let's get another dory. Oh, here we go. What are these? Are these jellyfish? Oh, I didn't mean to. I missed the jellyfish. Can I hit the jellyfish? Oh, I guess not. Wait, can I like... Oh, I can tackle him. Get him. Oh, fried jellyfish. Hell yeah, dude. These are where it's at. It's got these jellyfish. Perfect. All right, let's go turn this fish in. All right. Looks like you caught quite a few. At this, we'll, we'll make boatloads of money in no time. Whoa. My, my. Would you look at the time? We'll have to hurry up and get things ready. Why don't you head back to the sushi bar? All right, let's head back to the sushi bar. This was a good day. I got a couple of these uh, fried egg jellyfish. Yeah, look at all of them, dude. Hell yeah. By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning and once in the afternoon. Get the ingredients ready before the dinner hour starts. Oh, geez. I wonder if we have, like, a specific amount we have to catch, uh, like, every time, you know? Bunko, how are the preparations coming along? Hmm, I think we're mostly set. That's good. Here's to a great evening. Where do you think you're going? Didn't you hear from Cobra? You're here to help me run the sushi bar from today onward. What? Uh, I don't understand. Cobra told me that there would be someone to help me with ingredients and serving. He said all I needed to do is cook. And who else is there for that but you? Wait, but I've never worked in a restaurant before. The guests will be here soon. I'll have to give you a quick primer, so pay attention. Oh, Jesus, okay. Mm. What? <laughs> Open the ingredients below. All right, ingredients. <laughs> here you can check your fish, crops, sauces, and all the other materials you have. <laughs> for now, that's all you need to know. Come back later for more information. All right, cool. <laughs> all right, now I'll show you how to register actual items to the menu. All right. <laughs> New recipes will need to be added in the menu before they can be sold to customers. There's a sushi recipe for the fish you acquired earlier, so try registering that to the menu. Alright, so we just hit add. And I'm thinking we do the uh, fried egg jellyfish. Alright, that probably wasn't that hard. Uh, actually, it wasn't. It was quite easy. Setting ingredients to auto supply will make things a bit more convenient. Let me repeat. Only food on the menu can be sold. If you run out of ingredients, you have to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. You can also enhance the flavors of the dishes, so try it out when you have enough ingredients. Now, use the ingredients you caught to fill up the menu as much as you can. Well, okay. Let's uh, add, what do we got here? The pyramid butterfly fish. We'll add a couple of those. We'll add... Ooh, we'll add the rainbow wasai fish. I don't know how to pronounce that. Well, I'm just gonna add everything, actually. Oh, that's pretty much it. Perfect. How long are you gonna stand there talking? That wasn't the right voice. <laughs> Give me a cup of green tea to quench my thirst. Hmm, have you perhaps poured green tea before? No, only soft drinks, I think. <laughs> I'll tell you how. Go over to Cobra. I'm going over to Cobra. Alright, pour the drink. Oh, I have to fill it up to the line? Oh, Jesus. It's like a little mini game, dude. Customers who drink tea of good or higher grade will pay more. Ooh, that's good to know. Wahaha! <laughs> As expected, Banco's green tea is quite something. Mmm, that tea really got my appetite going. Is there something to eat, perhaps? Depends as always. Why don't you try serving him some food while you're at it? Alright, so we gotta run back here. Grab the food. Come over here where I am to take this food. You can dash when serving food. Use shift to move quickly. Don't forget to watch your stamina. Uh, 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 run, my dude. Alright, here we go. Hello? You sent the package last week, you say? What in the world? Let me check on that. Cobra didn't even eat. He's always distracted like that. Mm. The food can't be reused, so we'll have to throw it out. Mm. It seems like such a waste to throw it away. <laughs> Bako Sushi never reuses food. We do not put food made for guests on the table twice. Mm. Well, alright. Damn, we gotta discard it now? That sucks. Everything looks about ready. Hmm, I haven't cooked for customers in a while. Kinda nervous. <laughs> 
Don't forget to press E after filling the menu for business to begin. Customers will order dishes from the menu. Don't forget to register dishes to the menu before the sushi bar opens. Okay. All right, let's hit E and let's get ready. Open. All right. I'm getting ready, dude. Oh, what the fuck, dude? They're already? Oh, dude, this is... Oh, okay. Let me go fill this. Fill some drink. Uh, okay. So, they want this. They want this. Oh, this is like overcooked, bro. Jesus. Okay. Dude, I'm doing great right now. Alright, I gotta sprint for this one. Dude, we're going through the fish like nothing. Oh, wait, hold on. We got some green tea here. Oh, dude, that's freaking perfect. Oh, let me let me go to this one first. Perfect, dude. I'm doing great. We're actually almost about to run out, too. Boom, instant. Oh, it takes a bit to scrub, too. Okay, that's good to know. Dude, I'm doing... This is... Okay, I was a little worried. I was like, bro, this seems a little overwhelming. No, this is easy as shit. Hell yeah, dude. Awesome. Closes for the day. Banku Sushi closed. Hell yeah, dude. That was awesome. I did really good right there. And I feel like, honestly, just to keep using the jellyfish is where it's at. You make a lot of money that way. All right, so we made a net profit of 67. Phew. Work's finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. We were a bit clumsy, but not bad for the first day. Try a little harder next time. I suppose coming from you, that's a compliment. Hee <laughs> hee. A man should not feel gratification for the simple compliments. Yeah, yeah, all right. In any case, a toast to the opening of Banco Sushi. Yay, first day, dude. Oh, what's this? A little cutscene? What's going on here? Oh shit, he just rammed into that. Yeah, he hit a couple barrels, my dude. What was that, the Kraken? Dude, what the hell? That's freaking terrifying. Oh my god. Sunday, October 2nd. Oh, Ellie's calling me. Hmm, I- Oh, this is- Okay, this one's actually gonna be the worst, so I apologize. Hmm, are you the man who's been diving around here? Yeah, I think so. I was expecting a more professional-looking guy. I can hear you, you know. In any case, can you do something for me? Shouldn't you tell me who you are first? I'm Ellie. I study biology at the local graduate school. I've come out to investigate after reports of anomalies in the area. Satisfied? Okay, so what do you want? I'd like to study the ecology of Blue Hole. Get me some agar and red starfish first. I don't think it's a good idea to ask for just one of each, so get me two of each. Your tone makes me want to refuse. Hmm, I've got a reward, but if you don't want it, that's fine by me. Hey, re reward? Well, I wasn't refusing. I'm just saying you could ask more nicely. In any case, please hurry. Don't dally. Oh, that was actually- I am so sorry to all women everywhere. That voice was of actually- probably so offensive. Not offensive, but just so wrong. You can use your phone to access various types of content, check your current missions, and more. Cool, dude. Alright, so. Uh, there's not a whole lot we can actually click on, so. So we need to acquire two agar and acquire two red starfish. It's a little side quest action, but... Yeah, mainly I just gotta go for the big boy fish. Alright, that's a little sea urchin. I don't know if I can just, like, pick that up, or... Oh, I could just... Oh, it hurts! I don't think sea urchins should be picked up with these gloves. Oh, so I have to get newer gloves. That's good to know. So let's get some fish here. We got some over here. Actually, there's one right here. Let's just catch as many as I can. Oh, he's running away from me. Oh, we also have a weight limit. That is good to know. Oh, look at this buried treasure. Is that a sword? Cheap Japanese sword. I could switch out weapons? That is so cool. 
All right, let's get some more Dories or Blue Tang. I'm just uh, scarring children everywhere. I don't think fi those fish are really worth much. I gotta go for more of these uh, ones down here. Dude, this music is so groovy. Hello. All right, where are these? Oh, look at this. Can I just like... Oh, it looks like I have to attack this one. Dude, I gotta get this. Oh yeah, rank three puffer fish. Let's go. What's this freaking copper ore? What the fuck? Ooh, look at those ones. I'm gonna look them right to me. Bam, baby. Oh, I can't capture that. Wait, can I like hit it multiple times? Oh shit. Mediterranean parrotfish. Oh, I'm at my weight limit. I gotta go. Uh, not necessarily, I guess. Oh, baby, mom! Look at that! Look at that thing, dude! That's huge! I gotta capture it. Actually, maybe I should get the chest first. Hold on. What we got? Oh, perfect! An oxygen capsule. Hell yeah, dude! Oh, let me get these uh for the side quest. Perfect. I'm going again. I'm gonna get this thing, dude. Get over here! Can I, like, attack it, like... Oh, here we go. Oh, I see. Alright, let me get out of here. I think that was a pretty freaking solid day. Oh, is that an enemy? Oh, shit, shit, shit. Oh, no, I died! Oh, no! I've been I died and I'm only able to receive uh, achieve one item. Jeez, dude, that sucks. Well, I gotta go for the big boy fish I caught. Like this is definitely gonna be worth it. Damn, dude. Okay, I didn't know. I saw the little dot, like red dot, and I was like, oh, he's just fine. Dave, this giant blue hole looks infinitely more dangerous than any other place. <laughs> Always pay attention to your oxygen and use the escape pod when you're in danger to get out quickly. <laughs> I could rescue you if you run out of oxygen, but you're only able to bring back one item you collected. Oh, and that's it for the day? Hmm. Dave, did you get to loosen up yesterday? Hmm. Mm, I did notice that the fish in the blue hole have an odd violet streak. Perhaps something put them on edge. Speaking of which, why don't you also take a gun in addition to a harpoon? The fuck? Okay. A gun? That's my reaction, Dave. I have a friend who is knowledgeable about guns. I'll introduce you to him. Oh, who is this guy, Duff? Wow, Cobra, it's been a while. Sorry, that wasn't the nicest thing to say to a stranger. I'm Dave, a professional diver. Interesting. I thought divers are athletic and muscular. You seem to defy my prior knowledge. People who live in glass houses. Uh -huh. So... What's this about? I like you to get straight to the point. I've begun a very interesting business. Aha! And now I'm in need of a, some weapons, Duff. I need your help. Mm, season two of Sauce Seller just ended anyways. I'll give you a lesson. Alright! I actually discovered a fascinating giant blue hole. The terrain and ecology inside changes every time you go inside. Oddly, any equipment found inside breaks down when you bought it. Or brought out. I'd like to to make us a weapon that can be used inside. Yeah. Mm. That's rather interesting. You've piqued my interest as a weapon researcher, you could say. Yeah. My hypothesis is that anything that's not made from materials found in the blue hole will continue to break down. Yeah. This will be especially true for guns, which have precision parts. Yeah. Mm. So we'll have to get the materials from the sea ourselves. Yeah. Yeah, Dave, you have to prove yourself as a diver to get to this Master Duff. Uh, I'm not sure why I should have to prove myself to you. Just tell me what you need. Since it appears you have no guns at all, let's start with something easy. I think I'll need one rope and one scrap iron. I really can't do Duff's voice, Jesus Christ. You heard him right, Dave. Enter the blue hole and bring back rope and scrap iron. By the way, if you run out of oxygen midway, you're only able to make it back with one item. Always keep that in mind. Well, I know now. 
If you exceed your weight limit, you will slow down. If you exceed even higher amount, you won't be able to carry any more. Press escape to organize. Okay. Oh, jeez, dude. I gotta go back and get a lot of stuff, dude. Alright, I really can't mess up this time. We won't have anything for the sushi bar. I gotta get a lot of tiny fish, I think. Like these guys right here. Yeah, I gotta get a lot of these small boys, I think. And let's just have the starfish for, uh... Whoever her name was, Ellie. Was it Ellie? I think it was Ellie. Oh, look at this. Perfect, dude. Get some wood. Oh my god, dude. Taking so much damage. Yeah, dude, these jellyfish are gonna be worth a lot. This is where it's at. Honestly, I don't want to really worry about uh, wood right now. So we were looking for... Ooh, look at that one. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, that's an escape pod. Okay, what do we got here? Tell me I can get my katana back. Ooh, okay, a baseball bat. I will take that. Some rope. Look at that fish right there. Hold on. Oh, I'm, I'm out of the way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Over right there. Ooh, almost got it. Come on, baby. Get it. Boom, baby. That's how it's done. Look at these fish right here. Oh, it's going to take multiple hits, I think. There we go. Just beat him with the bat real quick. Bring him closer, swing with the bat, and finish him off. Boom, baby. All right, uh, so we got the two rope we need. What is this, iron? Oh, jeez. Oh, what's this? Dude, perfect, oxygen. Dude, look at this little freaking, oh shit. Okay, don't mess with him, holy shit. So we gotta look for iron. I feel like that's kind of deep, no? Oh, or not, it's right here. Oh, I'm at critical. Oh, that's a toy hammer. I gotta get that. Okay, so I really can't go super deep with my gear that I have right now. But these boys right here. Ooh, ooh. Right here. Boom, got him. Right here. Got him. Alright, let's get this fish right here. Bring him a little closer. Oh, look at these zebra fish. Oh, shit. They can attack me. Oh shit, 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 shit. Run, 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 run. Alright, let's get out of here. I don't want to risk it. I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go straight out. Actually, I'm gonna get one more. I'm gonna risk it. Actually, one more. One more. Boom, baby. Let's get out of here. Oh, that was, <laughs> that was a little close. Alright, let's return to the boat. Woo! That weapon sucks. What the hell is that hammer that I got, dude? That was nothing, dude. That was a little toy hammer. <laughs> Well, so Shinky actually managed to bring it back. I expected you to quietly expire in the depths, you could say. Per chance. Hmm. Okay. Seems that I've underestimated you slightly. Very well. I'll show you how to make the basic underwater rifle with these materials. Okay. I'm spitting all over the place when I do Duff's voice, holy crap. First of all, download Duff's weapon shop on your phone. It's well optimized, only 32 megabytes. You can say. <laughs> Dude, I love Doug. <laughs> Doug is a Chad. I don't care who what you say. Alright, let's craft this weapon. You just collected all the materials. Good. Let's try to create a new weapon. Dude, look at this Omega. Dude, what is this? Dude, little little tilt there. New weapon! Basic underwater rifle. Awesome. <sighs> With a neat explanation like that, even someone like you still haven't understood. Okay. Well, I guess. Yeah. Oh, and one more thing. Okay. I think there's some measures that allow you to open weapon crafts underwater. Oh. Whoa, weapon chests! Yeah. You can't bring them out of the sea, but they can still come in handy, you can say. Ugh, yeah. uh, but I'll collect info about the weapons you pick up and create blueprints for you. Oh, okay, so that makes you can just get blueprints and stuff. Weapons made with a blueprint won't break down underwater, you could say. In any case, this master will be watching you. Goodbye, Eternity. Okay then, Doug is a very interesting character indeed. You can craft weapons at Doug's weapon shop. Acquiring a weapon a certain amount of times will complete a blueprint, making the weapon craftable. Go hunting with powerful weapons. Awesome, dude. Hell yeah. Sweet, dude. Look at all the fish I got, too. I think this going to be a good day. All right, let's add these to the menu here. So what do we got? What's worth the most? Oh, we got to add these for sure. 
Let's max this bitch out. And then I gotta max this one out too, I think. Dude, I got some expensive freaking fish here, dude. Yeah, this is a pretty solid menu for tonight. All right. Well, with that, let's open up the sushi bar. Come at me. Come at me. Look at this little nerd right here, dude. Pick what you want already. Oh shit. Poor, 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 poor. All right, go, 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 go. Boom. Pour this guy a drink. Or pour this girl a drink, I should say. Dude, perfect again, dude. I'm so good at this shit. Right here, right here, right here. Boom. I'm salivating. I bet you are, dude. I love fucking sushi, so I get it. Oh, Dave! You collected 100 gold! Great job! This should be enough to repair what's broken. Then give me some time. These repairs need to be done right. I really hope the customers keep coming. Sweet, dude. Hell yeah. Alright, perfect. They don't want uh, fucking green tea, so that's helpful. Now you can just like camp right here. And let's finish this guy off. Oh shit, we got dirty dishes. Wipe, wipe, wipe! Okay. What do you want? What do you want? What do you want? What you got? What you got? You want green tea? No? Okay. You first. You've been here first. Oh shit. Alright, let me deliver this one and then I gotta go clean that up. Go, 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 go! Wipe, 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 wipe! Alright. Are you done? Are you liking it? Dude, hell yeah, dude. Dude, that was awesome. I made a lot that day, 120. I mean, I lost 100 because of the uh, the repairs and stuff, but that was quite a good day. All right, Monday, October 3rd. I thought that was him yawning for a second. What the fuck? Oh no, not another character. All right, I'm just gonna do this in my normal voice. Are you Dave by any chance? No. Yes, what is it, sir? Wow, I'm always right about these things. Aha! Nice to meet you. I'm Dr. Bacon. I'm an archaeologist who studies the Sea People Civilization. The Sea People Civilization? Aha! I'll explain it to you. Aren't you lucky to have an expert like me to tell you about them? Hmm, maybe. I shouldn't have asked. There's fucking mermaids? The Sea People Civilization lives in legends. They are said to have- uh, oh, I can't read that fast. They worship fish and had gills showing them to live under- Oh, I can't read that fast! They live in depths, allowing them to flourish without uh, any concern invasion of the civilization. <laughs> but some of the changes to sea bottom thought- but That's about all there is to the story. Everyone thinks it's a myth and nothing more, of course. But proof that they were real was found right in the vicinity of this place. Huh? This is an amazing find! One that could turn the whole academic world upside down. An ancient civilization under the sea. You'd only see such things in comic books or games. How convenient. What makes you so sure they're real? My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that it is from no known civilization. It's dated to be around 1500 years ago as well. There were no civilization in these parts back then. Hmm, that's interesting. But what business do you have with me? Well, you see, my assistant's cryptocurrency investments- Oh, Jesus Christ, didn't pan out, and he won't be around for a good while. That's why I'd like you to help me. Oh. My assistant told me that the artifact was found 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. I can't go that far. Also, we're busy with the sushi bar. I don't think we can- Aha! Sorry to interrupt the conversation. I'm Cobra. I work with Dave. Of course we should help you. We'll gladly do so. Oh yeah, ha ha! What? We don't have the time to swim around searching for artifacts. Think about it, Dave. If an auto-routed civilization is discovered, countless people will flock here. Bako Sushi will be bursting at the seams. Mm. Hmm. Um, I suppose you have a good point. Mm. Or have a point. Alright, I'll help. Aha! Isn't that lucky? Oh, of course, I won't be asking you to work for free. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're wearing for free. Yes. Whoa! With an enhanced diving suit, you will be able to venture deeper. This is essential for exploration. 
These days, even such things can be handled by an app. Technology advancements are amazing, eh? Let's first install the iDiver app on your phone before we proceed. Dude, hell yeah. iDiver. The iDiver app allows you to enhance various diving equipment, upgrade equipment with the money you make at the sushi bar and elsewhere, and explore deeper waters. Now then, let me tell you how to use iDiver. I'll install the app for you, so unlock your phone first. Alright. It instantly installs. Upgrade the diving suit for free. Hell yeah, dude. I can go 80 meters now. Good! Now you'll be able to venture a bit deeper. Once you have enough money, use iDiver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suit as well as your cargo box and oxygen tank. Never forget that anything can happen in deep waters. I'll be in touch. Alright, sweet. Now we can go deeper. That's awesome, dude. Traces of the Sea People. First chapter. I think, honestly, I really need to upgrade the oxygen so that I could stay down here way longer, you know? Oh, sweet, a weapons chest, dude. Oh, and another chest over here. Uh, sweet, I can get it to level 2 now. Awesome. I don't even want to use the sprint because it just uses so much oxygen, but I will be taking this. Yes, a baseball bat. Fuck yeah, dude. Alright, I want these big boys here. Right there. Oh, one more, one more. Bam! Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. There it is. Actually, let me whack this bad boy. Bam! Honestly, I, some of this stuff is easier when just whacking them. And bam, right here. Get it, get it, get it, Boom, baby. Lagoon tigerfish. Oh, I wanted these boys. Oh, these ones attack me too. Yes, huge. I'll get it tab. Okay, hold on. Oh, dude, huge. Oh, damn, dude. That's already freaking way over covered me. All right, let's head deeper into the deep abyss. Poison heart, dude. Yes. Oh, this is what I need too. Over here. All right, what do we got over here? Ooh, these ones are. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, I gotta poison it. <laughs> Alright, this is a quick extract right here. I might go for it. Ooh. Hold up now. I gotta go for it. Yes. I know I'm gonna weigh a lot. Oh, it's really not gonna let me max it out? Okay, hold on now. Well, I didn't want to pick this up anyways. So drop that. All right, let's get the chest. Oh, perfect, another oxygen capsule, huge. Man, these are worth a lot though. I should probably just drop like, honestly, just drop the fucking lionfish, dude. I don't care about those. I'd rather take this. It's huge. All right, this was a, a very successful mission. Oh, fuck, there's a stupid bitch. Fuck, I don't have any ammo? Okay, hold on. Let me try to go around him. Use the escape pod to escape to your boat as quickly as possible. Check your surroundings first as the calling process takes some time. Oh, okay. I see. So that fish were to start swimming over, it could attack me. Hell yeah, guys. Dude, I got a lot of stuff there. Oh, Ellie's calling me. Oh, woo. You actually brought them back? I guess I expected too little of you. All right. This should do for now. I'll give you a word as promised, since you helped me do my research. The sudden ecological changes in this region will need to be studied further, so I'll continue to need your services. And my number! Hell yeah, dude. Sweet, dude. Oh, dude. This game is so fun. I'm loving this right now. I got a ton of fish. This will be huge. And I can enhance it, too. Dave! While you were out at sea, the repairs were completed. Let's head to the restaurant. Whoa, it looks very nice. Or it's looking very nice. Aha! It doesn't matter how delicious the food is, the restaurant can't be a mess. Ah, if you want to change the interior, the interior menu below is open. So please check it. Oh, I can customize it? Oh, that's fun. You can now freely change up the interior of Banco Sushi. Use the interior tab to select the style of your liking. Ah, uh, but... 
As Dr. Bacon said, if the remains of the sea people are found here, customers will indeed come, but this area is kind of remote, so I think it will need a way to advertise the store until then. Mm. Yeah, these days it's just about impossible to attract customers without publicity. Mm. Oh, have you tried the social media app named Cookstu? Mm. You mean the social media app young people use to post pictures of the food they eat? Yeah, that's how all businesses are promoting themselves lately. I simply can't understand why people would waste their time like that. Sushi makes the impression on the hot, not photographs. Hmm, even so, isn't it better to use it than to keep people ignorant of your food, Bonko? You have a point there. Making an account is simple, so let's try it out. You first register and make the hashtag Bonko Sushi. Then, done! Hmm. Well, it's not as complicated as I expected. Okay. Now customers happy with your food will follow Bonko Sushi. Hmm, I'm not sure about this, but okay, I got it. Okay. I'll also install the Cooksta app on my phone and check out the followers posts. Raise your rating in Cooksta. More customers will visit and new foods will be unlocked. The unlock conditions of new ratings can be seen in the Cooksta app. Okay, sweet, so now I can customize the interior. I kind of like their oriental modern, to be honest with you. Uh, I don't want to pay anything right now. Yeah, I don't want to like spend any money right now. I want to use that for my suit upgrades. All right, so what do we got? Oh, I definitely, definitely. Oh, I'm gonna enhance it too. Dude, hell yes. Dude, what is this? Wow, this is magical. He's going Super Saiyan! Damn, dude, he was not getting about enhancing. <laughs> it's beautiful. Enhance has been completed! Hell yeah! Oh, dude, look at that! huge dude i'm thinking i should also upgrade the mediterranean oh it's not really that big of an upgrade now that i'm looking at ah fuck it might as well man i did not capture a lot of fish not gonna lie uh well i guess i'll just go for max happiness so which is this one all right that looks like a solid freaking menu and hopefully these sell the most so then i get the most money sweet let's start the day i think oh it's only at night okay that makes sense i i still have to fish during the afternoon duh perfect that gives me more opportunity to get the uh fish for the uh the really good expensive fish oh there's a dolphin oh hi mr dolphin i don't know what you're saying who a dolphin hmm it seems to be asking me to follow should i try and follow yeah sure fuck it let's do it let's go mr dolphin what you got i already have a lot of fish already so i'm really not too worried about it damn this guy's going fast hold on now oh there's a chest right here too what we got yes i will take the katana dude that's huge Ooh, more loot oh no little dolphin friend is stuck i'll, I'll save you oh wait hold on there's some there's some good stuff right here Ooh. A pink dolphin is caught in the net. Mm. So if it was asking me to rescue its friend or lover, mm. I should cut that net. All right, here we go. Let me cut the net up. I'm saving you, little cutie dolphin. I got gotcha. you. Aw, it's so cute. Aw. I got gotcha. you. Oh, where are they off to? Oh. Oh, it seems to have left a gift. I didn't even know dolphins had mates. What are you, stupid or something? I mean, come on, bro. Come on, Dave. What he left? A pearl. Dude. All right, I need more of the big boy fish. Ooh, underwater scooter. We got another one of these things. And stab it, kill it. Black and white strength snapper. Oh, Jesus Christ. I didn't even know it's a fucking shark there. What the fuck? Can I kill the shark? Come at me, nerd. Dude, I got it. 
Can I? Oh my god. Huge. This is a good trip, man. Oh, there's a fish right there. You're dead, you're dead, you're dead. I'm gonna shoot it a couple times. There we go. It might be a little overweight. Yeah, that's okay. Now let's get out of here, dude. Oh, dude, that's sick. I really need to enhance that shark. It's already evening. I feel stiff. Even so, Bonko's working alone. I should probably help. It's not easy to manage with two people with more customers coming in. Oh, we can hire people? That will be huge, actually. But Eye Diver, I'm definitely going to be upgraded this suit. I'm thinking, okay, I'm definitely going to upgrade the cargo because that's irritating as shit. And then might as well just upgrade the, the air as well. So now we can stay out for way longer. Wait. Here we go, we got another weapon making right here. Wow. This guy is, is an actual Chad. This guy is a Redditor. <laughs> Dude, the animation of this game is fucking incredible. Oh, who the hell is this? Oh, I... I don't even know if I want to do a voice for her. This is Bonko's sushi place, huh? Hmm. <laughs> Miss Yoshi! Hmm. I came by it because I heard this place is getting popular on the Coopster. The name gave me a pause, but to think it's really your place. New food? Using never before seen ingredients. Can't taste this anywhere else. I take, I take turn, but masculine chef. Whoa! Do they mention me too? No, not really. In any case, what brings you all the way here, Miss Yoshi? Oh, various reasons. I wanted to check out the restaurant. Looks like you're still the same. Well. There's nothing to change. I simply continue on day by day, training myself. My goodness, that is the problem. You refused to listen to me last time in a similar fashion. And that's what got you booted from my hotel. Hmm. You're talking about that again? That's the customer's fault for judging the food without even trying it. Hmm. How long will you continue treating customers that way? Hmm. To keep making the terrible food. What do you mean terrible? Whole roasted shark head is an excellent dish. Shark has been used in cuisine in both the West and the East. And in Korea, it was even used in ancestral rituals. Stop! You've not changed one bit. Let me judge for myself then. Whether it's food fit for consumption. Then I can tell you why I came. Fine then, I'll show you. I'll make sure you know the true taste of shark head meat. Bunko, isn't this development a bit sudden? Dave, as a chef, this is a fight I can't back off of. My pride hangs in the balance. Please give me a white head, tip, brief shed, shark, and olive oil. I actually think I already have that. You want me to catch a white tip, brief shark? Yes. With your skills, it should be easy enough to do. I think, like I said, I think I already got that. But a harpoon's not likely to be enough. Take a good gun with you in into battle. Even so, fighting a shark sounds way too dangerous. Do you mean to say you'll stand by while my pride gets trampled? The whitehead reef shark is usually found in the fa ocean far to the right. Good luck. He suddenly wants me to get him a shark head? This is preposterous. And it can only be killed with a gun? I'll have to ask stuff to make me a gun. Or search for one in the blue hole. I already got that, dude. Come on now. Sometimes special customers with a backstory will hear of the sushi bar and visit. Learn dishes that the customers want through research and serve them to the customers. Cool. I, like I said, I think I've already gotten it. You can now research new recipes. Use the artisan flame to extend your menu. Okay, let's research this. We're about to see something magical. Dude, my man is in full zen mode. Oh, just a drop. Just a dribble. Research has been completed. Wow. That is quite something. Well, I think we are ready to open the sushi bar. Oh, I'm getting ready because this is instantly getting served. 
Run, 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 run. Oh, disgusting as usual. The look of this just ruins my appetite. Even so, a promise is a promise. Oh, she's about to get a freaking world blown wide open. Oh my... Oh my god. How do you like it? It's good! It's tasty! I can taste the white tip reef shark fat inside the crispy whole roast. But it's not an overly cloying flavor. Is, is this ginger? The ginger scent mixes with the strong flavor of the head. It's quite lovely. Um, pardon me. I wasn't expecting to be this good. The Book of the Five Rings states that one should look at the essence of something instead of its appearance. Sharks look terrible on the outside, but they have robust meat in their head has the delicious taste. This whole roasted shark head brings such traits to their maximum potential. I must admit, this is good. You pass, Bunko. Let me tell you why I'm here then. This restaurant needs to hire people. I can help you with that. Huh? What do you mean? Do you still mean to go at it alone, Banco? This place is already operating at full capacity. Yeah, dude, I, my man can only run so fast. He's gonna start losing weight. Things might be okay for now, but you won't be able to cope with even more customers to come. I can't continue working alone, but it's not easy to find people I can trust. I'm Yoshi the Recruiter. This is what I do these days. Let's start by putting out a hiring ad. A scolding from Yoshi. Sweet, we need employees. Hire employees to reduce the workload. Employees help serve food in the dining area or make cooking food faster. Uh -huh. Let me tell you how to recruit stuff. Pay close attention to see what I say. Press the flyer to begin the hiring notice. Hiring has begun. Good. The recruitment results became available the following day. I'll tell you more tomorrow. All right. Sweet, dude. All right, that's four, 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 four. Boom, right there. All right, let me get this. Let me go here. Damn, dude, I freak I was trying to pour as fast as I can. All right. Don't don't want freaking tea, please. Thank you. Oh, this is intense. All right, all right, all right. All right, boom. Do you want tea? Do you want tea? No, you don't. You took too long. To he you hesitated. Okay, you don't want tea either. Too much hesitation. Run! I think she was here first. Alright, go, 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 go! Sweet. Dude, hell yeah, dude. That was a good night. Yeah, Bonko was not seeing it, dude. He is sweating now. Holy crap, 494, dude. Holy. Well, all right, you guys, with that night over and I'm making all that money, I think I'm going to end the video off here. Wow, this game is so fun. I was not expecting it, and the art style is so freaking cool. If you guys want to see more of this game, please let me know down in the comments because I would love to play more of this game. I, I, it looks awesome. If you've enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss any future content. Also, go follow me on Twitter, at Xenoclips. I post updates on upcoming videos and I'm always looking for suggestions on future games you guys want me to play just like this. Please suggest games just like this. This is awesome. If you guys want to go check out Dave the Diver yourself, I'll make sure to leave the link in the description down below so you can go and download it because you guys gotta get this. This is so fun. It's so good. And with that, I hope you all enjoyed and I will see you in the next video. Bye.